So in the series of learning Python programming language, in the previous video we have talked about you know how to print something on console, you know in Python. Or you can say we have written our first program to print hello world, fine. Now in this video we will see one coding exercise or you can say it is one assignment for you guys, okay, on print, on print function, okay. Now see, this is what you need to print, exact output I want on the screen, on console, three lines would be there. In first line, first program, this hyphen python print function, then it is declared like this, then these columns and print, then the single quote what to print, exact, as it is, these three, these three lines should be printed on the screen. So what you will print, how to print. So let's pause the video and do this exercise. So now I hope you have tried and you have printed that thing. So now let's see, I am going to create a new file, new file and uh, I am going to name it exercise 1 dot py ok. Now here only I will write down my code. So whatever you want to print, simply one statement whatever you want to print just write down in print function in these double quotes I have told you ok. So the first we have to write down first program, first program then this hyphen and python print function ok. Now in next line I want to print what it is declared like this three line I want. So it is declared like this and column and we know don't need to put any slash and all for new line because print will give invisible new line character. So automatic, automatically cursor would be next line. So in third line I want to print what as it is print in single quote what to print. So whatever that thing put that thing in the this print function print double quotes in this double quote simply write print single quote and what to print single quote bracket close and this I guess that is it. Let me just run this and show you what output you will get here. So it is still printing hello world because uh, from here you have to select current file ok or if you want to run this file so you can one more method is just right click on this and run exercise 1. So run it and see it is printing as it is what you, what you want to print first program then that the hyphen uh, program uh, python print function it is declared like this print what to print. So now I have told you or I guess I have not told you so let us discuss this thing first. So this is the output I want right. So now see how to use print function I have told you in previous video hello world if you want to print something just write down that thing into these double quotes the string or the message. Or in python you can write down this thing the message or the string in single quote as well. Single quote if you write down single quote if you put single quote hello world this will also give you the output hello world. Same thing double quote or single quote so this is correct in single quote also you can declare print something like this print in single quote whatever you want to print you can write down this thing ok. But here one problem is I want to print this line as it is. Ok, so I want to, I have to put this line as it is in this print like print and what to print as it is in double quotes, ok that is fine, it will run, ok. But if rather than these double quotes here also I want to print these single quotes, now it will not run, it will give error, why so, because see. For this print function this is opening uh, this uh, you can say single quote and this is closing. So it will consider this this print and this parenthesis as a string like this you want to print and this what to print it would not be considered as a string. After that this it would consider as opening single quote this would be closing single quote. So this parenthesis would also be considered as 
string but this would be what code it will not it will not consider this as string so what to print this is what code but what is this code programmer the, the interpreter doesn't know what to code I mean we cannot write down something like this here it is not a correct syntax okay so that is why it will give error so if you want to print on the screen on the output screen these single quotes so better to write down these single quotes better to enclose these single quote in double quote now this would be opening quotes you can say double quotes and this would be considered as closing so whatever you will write down here that would be considered as string okay and if you are writing here single quote so better to write down here within these double quotes okay so now for this print function this is opening this is closing so whatever you will write into here that would be considered as complete as a string i hope you got my point let's just do practical on this thing so let's see this was our exercise one this we have printed now if i put here rather than this i put single quote okay now better to first of all put double quote here and let me just give you an idea about like first program this line i am putting in single quote not double quote okay second line in double quote and third line also in double quote so let me just run this and it will give you exact correct output first program this 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 so you can put the string in double quote or single quote it doesn't care for python both are same okay now if i put here single quote in in this case i want to put here single quote so now see as you can see this print and this opening braces is only green see this complete line is green this complete string this complete string is green okay but this is what what to print is in uh, what to is in black and print print is you can say it's a function for this so it is in blue now this what to print is code for this interpreter so what to print it it is not any code like you cannot write down a code something like this it will give syntax error so this is a string this opening brace closing brace braces is a, is a string but this is what a simple code so if i run this then a syntax error you will get because you are not following the rules the syntax of writing a program whatever has been defined in python programming language so it will give syntax error see syntax error invalid syntax perhaps you forgot a comma right see in line number 3 in line number 3 this print what to print here it is a syntax error invalid syntax so now you have to put you can do something like this uh, you can do here double quote okay now it would be fine now let me just run this and what it will show on the screen what to print this would be in double quote okay but if you want to print single quote on the screen on the output screen i want to print single quote what to print so you have to put these into double quote outside these you have to put double quote double quote you have to use i hope you are getting my point whatever you want to say now let's just run this and it will print print what to print in single quote so the single quote double quote also you can print on the screen but you have to take care of this thing okay now i guess uh, this is clear to you guys so i hope everything about this print function is clear to you guys okay how to use this print what when to put double quote when to put single quote and these kind of things right so in the next video we'll see some uh, you know about string manipulations string a data type in uh, python that is string that thing we'll discuss and how to use that kind of data type in print that also we'll see and then according exercise okay so what i will do is first a query one concept query like print we have discussed query and after that one video on this coding exercise for this print so query concept plus one video coding exercise of that concept right so now see you in the next video till then bye bye take care